from Television City in Hollywood and from inside your computer, it's the $100,000 Pyramid. Hello and welcome to the $100,000 Pyramid. Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy B here with you, bringing you another new game here on the Mystery Monday rotation. Welcome to the $100,000 Pyramid PC game. Uh, this game, I don't remember the exact year when it came out, but this is an older version of the Pyramid game created by, uh, as part of the Game Show Network era, and, uh, we're gonna play through it. We're gonna do a few games of this as part of the Mystery Monday series, or we may turn this into its own separate series. You guys have to let me know in the comments below. But this is kind of sort of the test pilot, so we're gonna see how we do with it, alright? I already had, went ahead and set up the options prior to this, so we should be good to start. So let's start a new How game. How many people will be playing today? We got three options to play. We do single player, two player, and party play. We'll debut the two player and party play stuff later. As for now, though, we'll ship into play some single player stuff. One player? Mm, you must be getting a little extra practice in before your friends arrive. Very smart. Contestant, please tell me who you are. Hi, right, my name is Brandon. <laughs> In case I get the other brain to play too, I'll put my last I'm initial. So you join us today. Okay, contestant, time to choose your new identity. Um, this one looks pretty close to me if I had a suit. And minus the fro. And the glasses. And the slightly green complexion. But nonetheless. Excellent. Let's get ready to meet your celebrity teammates. Please welcome Wanda Winters. Wanda, wow, it's great to have you. Looks like you're ready to play. It's time to go over the rules of the game. All right, let's check out and see how to play this. On the board, you'll see six categories. You or your partner will pick a category off the board. You will then try to guess seven words that are related to the category you picked. To help you guess what the words are, your partner will give you a series of clues. When you think you know the answer, type the word into the space provided and hit enter. For each correct guess, you'll receive one point. At the start of each game, you'll be shown the number of points you need to advance to the winner's circle. If you fail to get those points, your game will end. The numbers will get higher as the game progresses. In the winner's circle, you will play for five consecutive pyramids. $5,000, $10,000, $25,000, $50,000, and finally, $100,000. You'll start by playing for $5,000. If you win, you'll play for a higher pyramid the next time you return to the winner's circle. If you lose, you'll stay at the same level. On the pyramid, you'll see six categories, each worth a different dollar amount. Your partner will give you word clues to best describe what each category is. Guess all six correctly, and you'll win the amount indicated at the top of the pyramid. Feel free to pass if you're having trouble. You can come back to a category later on. Just remember, the clock is ticking. Okay, those are the rules, so let's get started. Alright, let's do it. Take a look at our first pyramid here, up for grabs, and look at the six subjects we'll be playing with. The categories are displayed on the board. Go ahead and choose one. Okay, this is how many points you'll have to score in order to qualify for the winner's circle. Alright, pick. we need nine. So we have Life is Golden, Handle with Care, Sight Seeing, A Brand New Day, Stack em Up, and Big Deal. Well, Wayne Brady's the host, so let's make a deal. So let's make a big deal today. Are you sure you're ready for this category? Games Here played with cards. Perfect! I got this. All right, 60 seconds of the clock. Remember, if you want to pass, hit the tab key. Okay. This is a game you play when you're alone and you lay out uh, Solitaire. The cards, the ace. Okay. Uh, another version of this game is called Blank Rummy. Uh, it's also Gym. a clear. Nice. This is a card game that is also played with a, uh, a board with holes in it and you have pegs that you move forward on the board as you play. This is a card game that is also played with a uh, pass. pass. I don't know it. The object of this game is to get to 21. Blackjack. Uh, you play it with a dealer. Yeah. This is a game you play around a table. Um, jacks are better. Five cards. Poker. All oh, right. The opposite of peace is this. War. It's a game. Yes. Uh, your grandparents might play this. Um, Trump is a term used in this game. It, it's Bridge. Also, uh, yes. This is a card game that is also played with a, uh, a board with holes in it, and you have pegs that you move forward on the board. And Sorry? You this is a card game that is also played with a... Uh... I don't know that last one. Six out of seven. Not bad at all. 
You have four categories to choose from. Take your pick. All right, so we got six points, and I guess the categories are randomly uh, chosen by the other team that you'd normally be playing against. So, um, let's go with "It's a New Day." Yes, it is. Good choice. Here is your category. Things you see in the morning. Okay, I'll go with that. And go. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is uh, the moisture that accumulates. Do. Okay. When you get up very early in the morning, you'll see this. Uh, when it starts to get light in the morning. Sunrise. This is what, yeah. This is another word for cup. It's what you put your coffee in. It's Mug. Sort of a All right. A uh, boy on a bicycle throws this onto your doorstep every morning. Paper it boy. Has... Nice. Right. Okay, this comes in a tube, and you put it on a little brush. Uh, you put it in your mouth. Toothpaste. And you clean. Nice. This is a breakfast cereal. It's usually served hot with brown sugar and milk. Oatmeal. This is a breakfast. All right. If you drive to work, you see this. It's the term for a bunch of cars on the road and traffic got him nice seven of seven we have some very good teams here today i love Jeez, the animation these categories so far but now you need to pick one all right handle with care and stack them up is what i got left we're gonna go with um let's go with stack them up are you sure you're ready for this category places you find plates is. all right let's do it are you ready Yes. Let's go. Go. This is much larger than a hill. Uh, McKinley is one. Don't make a blank mountain a molehill. Yeah. This is a place you go to buy things. Uh, a shopping mall. Grocery I've store. Two hundred of these. This is a place you go to buy things. Uh, a shopping mall might have two hundred of these. This is um, a place you go to buy things. Uh, a shopping mall might have two hundred of these. Store. Okay. This is what you drive. It has license plates on the car. Front. Yes. This is what rests on top of your neck. It's where your skull is. Head. Yeah. These can be all you can eat. Uh, it's Buffet. A long row of... Nice. These are basically your kitchen cabinets. These are the little um, Shells. receptacles in your kitchen where you would put your plates, uh, maybe your food, dishes, that kind cabinets. of thing. Cabinets. These are basically your kitchen cabinets. These are the little oh. um, pass. pass. This is an appliance you find in your kitchen. You put all of your plates. Dishwasher. Ah, I didn't get it in time. Wow, good try on a very tough category. Hey, you make this look easy. I hope you remember the way to the winner circle. All Welcome right. Welcome to the winner circle. This is your chance to win some serious money. Keep in mind that you'll only need to type in the key words that describe the mystery phrases. Good luck. Here it is. Go. Um, a, a teddy, uh, a bra, a lacy bra, a garter belt, uh, silk stockings, or, uh, or lacy underwear. Um, a, a teddy, uh, uh, a bra, a lacy bra, a garter belt, uh, silk things. stockings, or, or lacy underwear. Pass. Pass. Cookies baking, um, roses, flowers. Uh, okay. Things smell good. Love, happiness. Uh, loyalty, your health, uh, right. trust, love, happiness, uh, uh, loyalty, your health, uh, trust, things you check, love, happiness, Earn. Uh, loyalty, pass, pass. Uh, your ears, um, tongue, uh, your nose, uh, your eyebrow, uh, your belly button, things uh, on your, your head, ears, um, tongue. Uh, your nose, uh, your eyebrow, uh, your belly button, uh, your ears, uh, um, tongue, uh, your with nose, holes. Uh, your Pass. ass, shopping malls, uh, large stadiums, airports, uh, big lots downtown, they could be underground, shopping malls, uh, large stadiums, airports, uh, big lots downtown, they could be underground. Pass. Pass. Eyeglasses, contact lenses, things that help you see, laser surgery. Wow, I only got one. Those are I tough. I only didn't beat this pyramid, but that's okay because you might get another shot at it. I hope you're ready to play another round. Wow, that is actually really rough the first time through. All right, um, I'll tell you what. Uh, Normally, I think I'd do just one of these per episode, but you know what? Uh, first time through, or this is the first time we're really getting into it. 
Let's continue on. Let's see if we can go one more time here. Let's see if we can do better. We're okay in the upfront game. It's the Let's bonus take a round. Look it's at the tough. pyramid to see our categories. All right, check out the number of points that you'll need to go on to the winner's circle. All right, we need okay, nine points. It's time to pick a new category. All right, we have in the slammer, easy does it, into the woods, let it rise, all aboard, and finally not speaking. Uh, let's see. Let's go with easy does it. Hey, it's the Seven Eleven bonus. Ah, you've chosen the Seven Eleven. Nice. I was hoping those bonuses were in here. Things that are fragile. Mm, let's play. Let's go. You eat this for breakfast. Um, this comes out. Egg. All oh, right. When a baby is, say, less than a month old, uh, it's called this. Not an infant, but... A newborn? Yes. This is a French dessert. Uh, it's very light and airy. And if you slam the oven door, it will collapse. Uh, this is a dang French it. dessert. Uh, it's very light and airy, and if you slam the oven door, it will collapse. All right. Souffle. This is uh, the way people think about themselves. And if someone's very arrogant, full of themselves, uh, you might say they have a big this. Ego. Big yes. This is a type of tableware, plates, bowls. Uh, it's very thin and usually quite expensive. You might register for it when you get married. China. Okay, this is a, a very expensive type of glassware. If a couple is getting married, they might register for China and this. Okay, this is a, a very expensive type of glassware. If a couple is getting um, married, they might register for China and this. Ooh, sorry, you two. Wanda, you played before. You know you can't win them all. Two categories off the board. Four more to go. What's next? All right, um, wow. I thought I would have done better that time around. All right, let's do um, Into the Woods. Good choice. Here is your case. Things associated with the forest. Okay. Things associated with the forest. Ready? Ready? And let's go. go. When you are chopping down a tree, this is what you yell. So Timber. Nice. These are people who cut down trees for a living. They wear boots and flannel shirts. Uh, These lumberjacks. Are people who cut down. Okay. These are people who believe in protecting land or water. Uh, they might chain themselves to a tree to keep it from being chopped down. Uh, These are people who believe in protecting land or water. Oh, right. These are the creatures in the forest, not vegetable or mineral, but nice. animals. This is something that's used to cut down trees. It uses power. It makes a lot of noise. Chainsaw. This is something that's used to cut. Yes are birds you see at night they go ooh, ooh. owls yeah this is another word for path it's something that you could hike on or ride a mountain bike on trails got it there we go got all seven nice if you can keep that up through the whole game victory is yours yeah just one or the other pick a category um let's go with all aboard good choice here is your category. Parts of a board game. Wow, okay. I was totally thinking train and they zagged me. All right, cool. Ready for the first board game. Let's go. Here it is. Go. Uh, these usually come in a little pamphlet or on a piece of paper. They're included in Instructions. a Instructions. Okay. This is like a tablet, but it's smaller. You, um, it has a lot of pages. Maybe you take messages on one of a these. A book, a uh, notepad. This is like a tablet, but it's smaller. You, um, okay. These are little cubes. You roll them. You dice. Say, All right. I was waiting for if that one. If you're playing one. a game and you're not using dice, but you need something to tell you how many spaces to move, you might have this. It, it's a little thing. It has sort of a needle that you flick, and it whirls around in a circle and lands on a space. If you're, yeah. A spinner. Uh, these are things that you write with. They're sort of like felt tip pens. When you take the lid off, they smell really nice. Markers. Uh, you can shuffle these. You can deal these. They're Cards. Like, yes. This is where you live. Um, it has a mailbox oh. and your address on it and your driveway. This is where you live. House. Got it. Had the buzzer. Great job. See, well, I couldn't have done that on the 7 Eleven. I could have got the $1,100 like bonus. We have a winner. Congratulations. You did great. Next stop for you is our winner's circle. All right, trying for okay, $5,000. The winner's circle. Good luck. Hopefully, you do better this time around. All right, 90 seconds to get six subjects. All right, focus in. Here's your first subject. Go. Oh. 
uh, the Super Bowl, uh, motocross, um, monster truck <laughs> racing, uh, gladiator battles. Uh, the Super Bowl, uh, motocross, um, monster truck <laughs> racing, uh, gladiator battles. Pass. Pass. Necklaces, bracelets, uh, anklets, rings, jewelry. Earrings. Necklaces, bracelets, uh, anklets, rings, earrings. Necklaces, bracelets, uh, anklets, um, rings, earrings. Necklaces. Pass. pass. Nine eight one two 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 three one eight five five zip five. codes. All oh, right, a toaster, um, a place setting, um, flatware or silver, uh, towels, uh, bed coverings, a toaster, um, um, a plate, pass. pass, saxophone, piano, French horn, guitar, oboe, saxophone, piano. French horn, guitar, uh, oboe, saxophone, piano, uh, yeah, instruments, uh, Mars, uh, Pluto, yes, Planets. Uh, the Super Bowl, uh, motocross, uh, monster Events. truck racing, uh, gladiator battles, uh, the Super Bowl, um, uh, dang. Well, I didn't get this pyramid, but that's okay because you might get another shot at it. I hope you're ready to play another round. All right. Well, two times through, did not do as well. I did better this time, but I could not get all six subjects. I got a total of eight hundred dollars so far, and I guess we'll have to pick that up for next time. All right. So we'll just save it under my name. And that is all we got time for today for this round of $100,000 pyramid. Let me know what you think about the game. And if you want to see me try to play through and get to the $100,000, uh, let me know in the comments below. But in the meantime, between time, thank you so much for watching. Remember, if you like the series and you want to see more of it, all you got to do is click that subscribe button down below and ring the bell. That way you never miss out on all the fun and games going down here at MVG Productions. Help me reach my 1,000 subscriber goal. In the meantime, between time, until I figure out how to climb this pyramid properly without falling on my face, I'm your host, Brandon Scruggs, saying thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all next time. Take care. Bye for now, folks. Departing contestants will receive some of these prizes. Screamer size. The modern way to lose weight and to work through emotional issues. <laughs> Mike Michael's jeans for bow-legged men. Your legs will thank you, and so will your horse. Big pile of rocks. Whether you're building stuff, smashing stuff, or just throwing stuff at people, you can't go wrong with a big pile of rocks.